Hello everybody and welcome to another Vintage Fans and More video review brought to you today by Quorum International. Throughout my few days spent down in Texas at Light Ovation, I was able to meet with just about everybody from Quorum who was in attendance. Everybody there was very receptive and interested in what I do through my platform here at Vintage Fans and More. Until recently, I have not had a lot of background in Quorum products. When they brought out the windmill, that really piqued my interest in the brand. So over the past year or so, I've been slowly familiarizing myself more with their products. There are some interesting fans from this brand for sure. Their fan catalog is absolutely enormous. With that said, you can expect to see more Quorum fans here in the future. Today we're taking a look at the 44-inch windmill fan, which is a new addition for this year. A couple years ago, Quorum introduced the 60-inch and 72-inch windmill fans, which absolutely blew up the industry. Everybody had to get a windmill fan and it quickly became a bestseller. But with a bestseller will come feedback. Customers and retailers were asking left and right for smaller sizes as well as light kits. Quorum listened to that feedback and this year came out with the 52 inch and 44 inch windmill sizes as well as six light kits exclusively for the windmill series. This has been a long introduction to the brand and the product so let's get into those technical details. As I mentioned, the windmill is now available in four sizes, 44 inch, 52 inch, 60 inch, and 72 inch. All sizes are available in two finishes, either oiled bronze or the galvanized shown on my fan. The blades are a weathered oak finish in either case. Each size also comes in a version for indoor use only or an alternate damp version for outdoor use in a covered area. Again, there are six various light kits now available for the windmill series. Installed on my fan is a single light fitter with clear seated glass. These light kits do ship with the LED filament bulbs included, which is something that Quorum has been working toward across their entire line of ceiling fans and light kits. Included with the windmill is Quorum's DC wall control. It offers six speeds, reverse function, and light and dimming functions all at the wall control. An optional handheld control is available to suit your needs. The 44 inch windmill moves 1,941 cubic feet of air per minute. This is based on the new energy guide standard for 2018. It averages the high and low speed CFMs. I was talking pretty in depth with some of the guys at Quorum about this particular fan. They really stress the fact that this fan is a marriage between form and function. It may not be the best air mover in any of its respective size categories, but it makes a statement like no other. I definitely have to agree there. Since this fan came out, there have been some similar styled fans coming out from other brands. That's been interesting to watch, and there are one or two others that I enjoy, but I don't think anybody else has executed this concept as well as Quorum has. This fan really looks like a true classic farmstead windmill. And moving back to the air movement, I was really quite impressed with how this model performs. It has a great blade pitch listed at 30 degrees, and those DC motors are really designed to drive those heavy, highly pitched loads. I think these fans are optimized very well considering they could have been marketed purely for their design impact without considering the air movement aspect. I've moved over and put the fan on low speed. The light kit is also on and dimmed. There is a good solid light breeze being put out. Because this fan has so many blades, it does produce a very smooth air movement with minimal wind noise. With the profile that the windmill series has, it's best suited for ceilings nine feet and higher. You can put it on lower ceilings with a short down rod, but at that point you may start restricting your air movement. You may wanna ask yourself if you're choosing the fan for the air movement aspect or for just the appearance. This fan is one of the most beautifully built that I've worked with in a while. All of the metal parts are very nice. The stamped parts are of a heavier gauge steel and the finishes are impeccable. This is one of the parts that I love discovering when I work with a brand that's new to me. When I find a product that's built well, I get excited about the brand and finding out more about what other products they offer. So having the opportunity to actually see and feel and work with this fan in person has gotten me very excited about what else Quorum has to offer. We are now up to high speed and I am not disappointed by the air movement from a fan of this size. A 44 inch fan is likely going to be in a smaller space. This is plenty of air movement for a typical room that this fan would be installed in. You can hear, or maybe rather not hear, how absolutely quiet this fan is even on high speed. 
The DC motor is essentially silent and there's only a light aura resulting from the air movement. I am thoroughly impressed with the overall performance of the windmill series. Now there will be an installation video coming up for this fan in the near future. I just want to throw in here that this fan does take some time and patience to assemble and install. I do believe that this is the most intensive and time consuming ceiling fan that I have ever put together. It's not for the faint of heart, but the end result is absolutely worth it. With that, I'm going to throw you to the montage so that you can see the windmill in greater detail, and I will be back at the end of the video. I've stopped the fan in advance. Normally with DC motor products, they spin down pretty quickly. However, the windmill, even in its smallest form, has quite a bit of weight to it, so it continues to spin for quite some time. Just one more detail that separates this fan from most others on the market. If you enjoyed today's video, be sure to let me know in a comment below or by giving this video a thumbs up. You can also leave comments letting me know what other quorum products you'd like to see. We already have a few other products lined up going forward, but as always, I'd like to hear your feedback. A big thank you to my new friends at Quorum International for making today's video possible. I can't wait to share more of their products with you. You can find links for me and Quorum International all across social media in the description below. Thank you all for watching today, and I will see you next time. Click left or right to continue watching. More Quorum videos will be coming soon.